Good morning, everyone. Hey guys, look what I have on the clipboard. I have a 500X, 500 times the cash. And let's hope we can get that 25 million top prize. All right, this is what they call stinky pinky. <laughs> let's scratch. What do you think? Do I have a chance? I don't know, but this is ticket number 19. I hope I do. I'm gonna give it a shot anyway. <laughs> Takes a little extra muscle to scratch this ticket. And it has a lot of numbers on it. I hope I can keep up. But if I miss something, just send me a message. I always try to scan my ticket. Sometimes I miss scanning a ticket. Have you played this ticket? Has it been nice to you? I had a doctor's appointment yesterday. <clears throat> Still not 100%, but hey, much, much better than I was. We're gonna switch to some new medication and hopefully that's gonna clear up everything else. <clears throat> okay, I don't think I see anything so far. My goodness. I know this ticket can be brutal. It can be nice too. <laughs> And I sure wish it was nice to me today. But it's not coming up there. Nothing, nothing. I only bought one, so... I might have bought it at the wrong time. And I didn't buy this at Publix where I usually buy my tickets. We were at a gas station <laughs> and I decided to get one. I was just hoping and I didn't know which ticket to get. They had two rolls. Number 10 was on the first roll and on the second roll was this one number 19. So I told a clerk, just pick for me. I don't know which one to get. So she did and she rang it up and she stacked everything up where I couldn't see the ticket number. So I just put everything in my pocket until I got out. I had to wear a jacket that day. Can you imagine? It was a little chilly here. So anyway, I put it on my inside jacket pocket and I didn't look at it until after I got in the car. My husband was driving and I said, oh, I just have to peek and see which one she gave me. Because I told my husband what I did. And he goes, well, he would have picked. He told me he would have picked um, number 10. And I said, yep, me too. I was thinking I would have picked number 10. But I didn't know, so I let her pick. But I won't feel bad, you know. You never know what you're going to get. So we either would have had something early in the roll or something late. And since the odds are so bad on this ticket, I think it's one and four and a half. I don't buy that many tickets at once. And I haven't bought a lot of these. I could probably count what I've bought on two hands. Probably about 10 of these tickets is the most I've bought.
And this one looks like it's gonna go in my losing pile. And it's not being nice. It didn't even give us one number. Yeah, all right, we just gotta check the bonus. If we don't get the bonus, I busted again. I'm sorry, that's the way it's been lately. And there you go, I tried. I hope your ticket's luckier than my ticket. Go out and have a great day, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.